What's good, YouTube? Nappy Boy 92 here, back again. Fucking down button work. <laughs> back again, once again. Today, people, today, we are back with some more Pokemon Soul Silver for you guys. Uh, if I am correct, which I think I am, I like to think I am at least. Uh, <laughs> this is episode numero cinco. And right off the start, we are going to get into this battle with, I think his name was Bird Keeper Peter. Doesn't really make a difference because I'm just gonna. Bite the shit out of that nigga! Anyways. <laughs> woo sa that be woo -sa. <laughs> Anyways, yes, I am hyped. I am excited to be back playing some more Soul Silver. Last time we journeyed south of um, Violet City on our way to Azalea City. I think we visited the uh, Unknown Ruins as well. Um, but yeah. We did all that heavy shit. We also caught a Mareep last time, which I really don't know why I'm not using that Mareep right now. Um, I know Totodile is about to level up here soon. Uh, actually, yeah, let's do that. Let's just go ahead and use Mareep. That's why we went to the Pokemon Center to heal, so we could train Mareep uh, and get 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 him. I almost said her, because Mareep is like, I don't know, to me, Mareep is like a feminine Pokemon to me. It just looks feminine, you know, the fluffy little wool and all that shit. But anyways, that's besides the point. Uh, yeah, we need to get uh, him leveled up a little bit, get him on the path to uh, evolution, and... I did look it up, people. Um, Mareep does evolve into Ampharos. Mareep, Flaffy, Ampharos. So that's good. That's good. Um, <clears throat> that'll that'll supply the electrical Pokemon necessity that we need in our party to uh, dominate and shit all over everybody. Yeah, yeah, all that good shit. Anyways, enough catching up. Mareep is taking fucking forever to kill this spear. Holy shit. Can we learn Thundershock sometime soon, please? Some type of additional move besides Tackle so these battles can go just a little bit faster? That would be really, really nice. Thanks. Work on that, Marie. But, uh, but yeah. So, I'm, I'm happy with that. I don't, uh, I don't really know the direction I'm gonna take my team yet. Um, so far I'm just rocking with Totodile, Pidgey, and Marie. That nigga is paralyzed! Yeah! Um... Uh, Actually, I lied. I lied. I lied. I lied. I have the idea of one Pokemon that I want to get. It's a Pokemon that I have not used before, period. Like, I mean, I've caught one before, don't get me wrong, but I've never used him actively in a party, and I've definitely never used him in a Let's Play, so once we get towards that area, um, damn, Marie, go ahead, get that level up, nigga. Get that level up. Um, once we, uh, whatchamacallit, I'm, I, I would use a potion on Marie, but I mean, we're right here next to Pokemon Center. Fuck it. Once we get there, I'm gonna catch said Pokemon and add them to my team. But outside of that, I have no idea what the uh, last two Pokemon on my team are gonna be. So, yeah. We'll have to uh, cross that bridge when we get there. But I think the next thing that we need to be doing is acquiring some sort of uh, quote unquote HM slave. Because we got shit like this in the way. Fucking. We have Rock Smash. There's another thing we got in the last episode. We have. Get up there! We have Rock Smash, we got that shit. Uh, that's not an issue. Union Cave, ooh. But we need to get a Pokemon, which if we're in a cave, we should find like a, a Geodude or something, right? Right, right? A Rattata, what the fuck? You don't expect to see a Rattata in a goddamn cave? God damn it. Uh, I think what I'm gonna end up doing is, I'm probably going to do some off-screen training for, f uh, I almost said Flaffy, for Marie, just to get it leveled up. Um, cause I don't wanna sit here and have 50 minute battles the entire fucking time with the goddamn Reap. So I'll just use Totodile and Pidgey for now. To, uh, can I, can I go through there? Woo! I didn't think I could. What's up here, though? God damn it! <laughs> uh, oh, there we go, there we go. That's what we wanted, that's what we wanted, that's what we needed. Um, Totodile's pretty fucking strong, but I don't think a scratch will kill him. At least I hope not. No, definitely not. Alright, so that'll work. I'll use Scratch a couple more times. We'll catch Geodude. Geodude will become our immediate HM Slave. Geodude can't learn Cut, which sucks. I can't think of one HM Slave that's easy to be found early enough in the game that, um, can learn all the HMs you need. Like, I don't, I can't remember the last time I had a Pokemon that can learn Cut and Strength. You know what I mean? Like, maybe like Meganium, but I mean, you ain't gonna catch no Meganium at the beginning of the fucking game, you know? So... Not like you're gonna catch him again, ever. So, <laughs> but anyways, we're gonna go ahead and pick up this Geo dude and uh, add this nigga to the party so we can get some rock smash action going on. 
Yeah. Yeah. I'm heavy. All right. So Geodude is not going to become part of our quote unquote team. He's a part of the party, but he's just here for, um, like GP. <laughs> uh, that sounds so bad. I hate, I hate the term HM slave, but I mean, that's, that's what he is. So, and no, I did not come up with that, but we are going to actually, let's teach him Rock Smash right now. I should teach Pidgey Roost. Pidgey might learn Roost, actually. I don't know. Obviously, Pidgey won't learn Roost, but, um, damn, we needed you, dude. Nobody else could learn that shit. Let's see here. Let's use it. Fuck it. YOLO. I'll probably never end up using this. I forgot we got this goddamn egg in our party, too. Shit. All right, then. This move should be forgotten. Uh, let's get rid of Sand Attack. YOLO. I say YOLO a lot, but it's like sarcasm. I'm not like seriously like advocating the use of the word YOLO. So please don't think that. Please don't think that like I'm a dickhead because I say YOLO. Swag swag. YOLO. <laughs> Anyways. Let's go ahead and get a fucking water gun off on Geodude. I hate that this ROM for whatever reason doesn't have the, the speed up feature. I mean, while playing the game, it's a little retarded. I don't like the fact that I can speed up, but when you do Let's Plays and shit, it's like a motherfucking crutch. And I got a broken leg, nigga. God damn it! I hope this item, whatever it is outside this cave, is worth getting. So I don't have to go through all this shit in vain. But hey, Total is getting a lot of fucking XP. That's nice, that's awesome, I'm happy. Oh, 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 oh. nigga stood no chance. I hope that, uh, I think, I think it's Bugsy. Bugsy's the next gym leader in Azalea Town. I hope that Bugsy has some sort of, uh, proficient Pokemon. Because my team is going to shit on her if she doesn't. Would you like to use Rock Smash? Yes, I would like to use Rock Smash. <laughs> Bam. A Shell Bell. A motherfucking Shell Bell. Are you for real right now? Let's see what this goddamn shell bell does. An item to be held by a Pokemon. The holder's HP is restored a little. Oh, well, yeah, let's use that. It's kind of nice. <laughs> I just got pissed over a shell bell. It's pretty fucking nice. Only downside is that that's going to like increase the uh, number of fucking turns that we have in each fucking match. Because if, if it's uh, like if Totodile lost health, all of a sudden. Chuka, chuka, chuka. Yeah, I just made that sound. Oh, I can run up there? I didn't know that. What the fuck? Yeah, it's going to increase the, the amount of turns in each fucking battle, or text on the screen at least. See, watch. Water gun. In your face, nigga. Take that damage. Super effective. Geodude faded. Shell bell. So, yeah. <laughs> Either way, so I know we can go down there. What the fuck is up here, though? This motherfucker! Look at this dude. This is like the uh, pyromaniac. If there's light, a cave isn't scary. If you're strong, Pokemon aren't scary. I feel like that's his voice, just based off of like what he looks like. Fire Breather Ray! My bad. I said pyromaniac. It's Fire Breather Ray. With his weak-ass Vulpex. Nigga, I got water-breathing Totodile. Yeah, I said it. I said that shit, nigga. Water breathing, don't I? Yeah. <laughs> bye bye, Fire Breather Ray. That shit went fast as hell. And boop, 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 boop. Chooka, chooka, chooka. Whatever the fucking noise I made last time it was, Shell Bell's gonna work as well. I fucking love it. Suck my dick, Ray. Nigga said Flash. Get the fuck out my face. What we got? Let me, let me down the steps. There we go. So, what are we working with down here? Oh, items. Fuck! <laughs> Geodude. A wild Geodude appeared. This is like deja vu. Water gun, nigga, water gun. That's all I'm gonna do throughout the entirety of this cave. Which is water gun. And, like, if I remember correctly, like, even though Union Cave has, like, these areas where you can use surf, this water shit, like, I never come back here. 
Like, I don't. Like, I, like, I don't remember ever coming back here or if anything is useful in here. I'm not saying that there isn't, but I just don't remember it. You know, like, this is one of the, it was like a letdown of the game. Like, you would always be like, oh, when I get whatever, I'm going to come back here and find out what's on the other side. That's water. Ah, I can't wait. And then, like, you finally get surf and you're like, let's go back. And you go back and there ain't shit there. Yeah. Just a little personal moment I had there. Because there ain't never shit there. So there ain't shit down here either. Rock Tomb. Great. Awesome. Not ever going to use that. Because I'm not keeping Geodude. So this room was a fucking waste of time. <laughs> waste of time. But hey, told her I was getting the training, so I ain't mad. I ain't mad about it. Rat Taddy, you squeak attack. Nigga, you stand no chance, nigga. Stand no chance. So boom. Hopefully, Totodile will evolve by the end of this cave. I mean, it's, it's looking like he is. I mean, he's halfway to level 18 already. So by the time we go fight Bugsy, we should have a Croconaw. Which, you know, some people could say, hey, you're a little overleveled. You're, you're OP to face that gym leader, bro. Well, I don't give a fuck, bro. How you like me now, bro? I'm on a mission to be the very best, bro. Like no one ever was, bro. So why the fuck can I have my motherfucking Pokemon level I fucking want, nigga? Shit. Anyways, dude's got an Onyx. I've always liked Onyxes. Don't ask me why. Just it's he's cool. Like he's a big badass Pokemon. And then you find like level 11. Like what? Level 11 Onyx? Like this nigga is like four stories tall and he's level 11. He's weak as fuck. This little ass Totodile just killed him. Makes sense, right? Only in Pokemon! <laughs> Anyways! Oh! 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 Nigga! Oh! Oh! Nigga! Oh! 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 <sighs> Pokey Cures Randy. <sighs> Let's talk to Mom. Hello! Oh! Hi, Navi! How are you? I found a useful item while shopping, so I bought some- BITCH! Don't you spend my fucking money! Don't you spend my money! I ain't give you permission to spend my motherfucking money! You're supposed to be the bang! So I bought it with your money. <laughs> Sorry! But I asked the delivery man to take it to you, so you should stop by the nearest Pokemart or department store and pick it up. I know it'll be useful! This bitch is buying shit with my money. Ain't that a bitch! Ain't that a bitch! Alright, nigga, let's fight. Let's fight. Let's fight! Uh, you're headed to Azalea, are you? Let my Pokemon see if you are good enough to battle. Dude, you don't want it. You don't want it. You don't want it. I'm gonna shit on your little Pokemon. You got a Geo, dude? You don't want it. Level 4? Are you serious? I just fought a level 11 Onix, and you got a level 4 Geo, dude. You for real right now? You for real right now? I mean, like, I mean, like, is you for real right now, though? I don't think you for real, nigga. You ain't for real. <laughs> 60. Oh, there it is. All right. So we know what's about to happen at the end of this fucking battle. Nigga total down level 18. <laughs> Let's just keep on battling. Let's keep on trucking. I'm going to switch out to uh, Pidgey, though. Because I have a feeling that Pidgey and Mareep. Not, no, not so much Mareep because he's a little bit weaker. I got to do some off-screen training to get him up. But uh, I have a feeling that Pidgey is going to be our rock in this next gym because I mean even though it's bug and Totodile's water I still don't think Totodile's gonna stand that that great of a chance in the next gym so we'll have to see never know Totodile could pull out the clutch or I should say uh Croconaw spoiler alert in case you didn't know what was about to happen <laughs> but now that all that shit's done and out the way Shell Bell full health ain't even gotta go to Pokemon Center Woo 124. Goodbye, Russell. Am I strong enough, bitch? Am I strong enough? That's what I thought. <gasps> what? Totodile is evolving. Pokemon do that? I didn't even know this. Has anybody ever actually hit B on the evolution? Like, I'm always scared because I don't want to like stop my Pokemon from evolving. Congratulations, you Totodile evolved into a motherfucking crocodile. Yeah. He reminds me of the baby from uh. Look at him. Look at that dude. What up, nigga? You happy? You happy, nigga? Composed. He's composed. He reminds me of a baby from that show, Dinosaurs. You guys remember that from, like, super long-ass time ago? Not the mama! Not the mama! That baby? 
Look at this nigga crocodile. Oh, he's fucking awesome. Bite that zoo bat, nigga. Bite that. Bite that, bite that nigga. Ah, yeah. Clip his wings. Anyways, we gotta switch out to uh, Pidgey so Pidgey can get some uh, training here as well. Normally, I like to work with even numbers, but you know what? Crocodile evolved. Actually, no, I'll leave Marie right there. Crocodile, I mean, Totodile evolved, so let's get Pidgey some training so we can get our Pidgeotto on. So this this will be good to see how Pidgey fares in the tunnel because I mean if Pidgey is just ass in the tunnel I'm not gonna keep using Pidgey the entire time you know I'm just gonna switch back to Crocodile so we can get out of here real quick yeah I'm gonna probably have to switch back to Crocodile <laughs> just so we can <laughs> fucking get through this shit and I'll I'll leave with Pidgey in the gym so that uh it can get some training and some experience as well well I don't know Gus seems to do a little bit of damage. So the flying type moves seem to be doing okay. Gust is the only flying type move I have though, so fuck. Can I learn wing attack? I remember, uh, whatchamacallit, fucking, uh... Actually, actually, fuck! Um, in my Sapphire Let's Play, I had Taylo and Swellow. And Taylo learned wing attack at like level 14, like where Pidgey's at now. And I remember looking it up, because I was like, when is Taylo gonna get a decent move? And I looked it up, and it was like, Pidgey doesn't learn wing attack till like level 36. I'm like, wait, what? Ooh, we got items. Great ball, yeah. But let's go ahead and fight this flaming. <laughs> I'm not even gonna finish that joke. Zubat Supersonic keeps confusing my Pokemon. I'm seriously upset about that. Nigga, I might remember that voice for like a real um. What's the word I should use here? I should use my words carefully. Uh, uh, a real flamboyant gym leader. There we go. Flamboyant. That's the right word. Remember that one. Put that in the book. <laughs> so the next time I run into a really flamboyant gym leader, that's the voice I'll use. Just like that. <laughs> I can't even take myself seriously when I do that. Come on now. Don't poison my Pidgey. You bitch. You gonna sit here complaining about Zubat confusing your damn Pokemon and you wanna fucking fuck up mine? Fuck you. Go to hell. You breathe fire. What are you doing with a coughing? Last dude had a fucking Vulpix and you got a goddamn coughing. What the hell's your problem, dickhead? Fucking poisoning my Pidgey. I was shitting your cereal. Watch me. Take out this other fucking coughing real place. Now I'm mad. Poison my goddamn Pokemon. What's wrong with you? Get this bitch out of here. Come on. Come on. Come on, let me get another fucking gust off. Oh, you small. I'm already poisoned, dickhead. You can't poison me again, bitch. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bye bye, coughing. Dick suckers anonymous. Go to hell. Blink. Pidgey little 15, nigga. Woo. Psych it. Get the fuck out of your fiber. I flamed out, bitch. Suck on these nuts. Now, I think, do we have, we don't have, fuck, we don't have, no, we don't have a, we have a repel though, I'm gonna use a repel, fuck it, just keep these dickheads away from me in this tunnel, we don't have a, Pidgey's gonna die, Pidgey's gonna die, because of the poison, and Mareep can't handle the tunnel, because all he knows is tackle, god damn it, Pidgey's gonna faint, I do want to see what's in the tunnel up here, though. I'm wasting my repel steps, too. God damn, I'm a horrible trainer. JK, I'm the best ever. Like, no one ever was. We could, uh, actually... That's another reason why I don't you I do not do Nuzlocke's right here, because of stupid shit like this. Because then my Pidgey would just be gone, all because of poison and a goddamn Nuzlocke, and that would just be retarded. So let's go on down here. And who the hell are you, mysterious-looking asshole? I roam far and wide in search of Pokemon. Are you looking for Pokemon too? Then you're my collecting rival. <laughs> Pokemaniac Larry, you are weird as fuck. You have a slowpoke. Pidgey would have actually done some shit against you, but you know what? Bite that nigga's tail off! Arr. Bite it off, nigga, bite it off. Deuces, nigga, deuces! 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 This is... Get that nigga out of here. <sighs>
<laughs> my poor Pokemon. Yeah, bitch. Get to stepping. So there ain't shit over there. Repel's effect wore off. Oh, fuck! How does Repel's effect wear off and I immediately get into a battle? What type of retardedness is that? I don't know if that's a word or not, but I'm coining that shit. Scratch the fuck out of this Rattata. Rattata, that's what I've called since I was young. It's Rattata. I always call it Rattata. Rattata, Rattata, Rattata. I don't know why. I added another ta on the end. But you know what? YOLO. YOLO. Fucking A! I took two steps! Holy shit! It's the exact same Rattata that I just killed. Well, since I'm not playing a Nuzlocke, um, I'm gonna go ahead and just have to let Pidgey just depart us for now. Um, I'll revive him at the Pokemon Center, of course, before I do anything else, but um, it sucks, because I'd love for Pidgey to get some fucking training. And this doesn't go anywhere. Because I'm pretty sure... Yeah, we're at the end of the tunnel right here, so... I can see the light! I can see the light at the end of the tunnel! An Onyx! Hmm. I wonder. I wonder if an Onyx would be a decent addition to our party. Because, I mean, I don't have any... Um... Ground-type Pokemon. I don't remember if there's an Electric Gym or not. But I don't have any ground type Pokemon. I don't have anything that can learn strength either. And I wouldn't have to have an HM slave if Onyx. Because I just teach Onyx strength. Hmm. Hmm. I'm torn here. I'm torn here on what I should do. Because at the same time, I don't want to, like, fill up my party too early, my team too early. Fuck it, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go ahead and get fucking Onyx for now. Let's go ahead and get it. Let's add to the party, and you know, if we run into something that's um Onyx isn't ground either, he's rock, but still, it's it's effective against electricity. Ah, see now I'm hesitant! Ah, I'm hesitant! I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it for now. Because I don't remember there being an electric gym. I don't. I think that I think it goes bug and then normal and then ghost, which I'm fucking hyped to go to. And then I know there's a steel gym. I know there's a fighting gym. That's all I can remember. So I'm not gonna worry about it right now. I'm not gonna worry about it right now. I'm not gonna stress over it. Come on, Pidgey, you can make it. If he was asleep, I'd have you covered right now. <laughs> but I'm actually going to save the game right now before I go through this door because, as you guys know from the. Uh, Second episode, the Soul Silver ROM does have its tendencies to lock up and shit, and we don't want that to happen. So I am going to save it, save it in game, and then actually save it as well there. So bam! So we are covered, we are good to go. So in case this shit freezes, which it didn't, oh, that's good. Uh, I want to explore, but I don't want Pidgey to die on me. Fuck it. I know, I know we're right here at the city. But you know what? I'm bowling. I'm bowling. I just said I'm bowling. I'm bowling. Bowling out and shit. I ain't gonna worry about it. Here you go, Pidgey. You can get some little PP. I won't let you die on me, nigga. I won't let you die on me. Don't die on me, nigga. Don't die on me. Give me these apricorns. Apricorns and shit. You got some shit for me? I ain't giving you a voice unless you have some shit for me. You wanna fight, nigga? That's what I thought. Azalea Town, okay. So I'll come back. Fuck! Team Dickhead is here. Yeah, I'll fight this dude since we're here now. Come on, Kraken I came through the cave, but there's still plenty of energy left. <laughs> plenty of energy left. Let's have a battle. My name's Hiker Anthony. <laughs> I have a level 11 Geo dude, and I hope it can beat your level 18 Crocodile, but it won't beat your level 18 Crocodile, because your level 18 Crocodile is a motherfucking beast, nigga! Now what? Take that shit. Yeah. Yeah. Die, nigga, die. 
<laughs> and that was that. That was all she wrote. Crocodile is just going hand with that shell bell too. Holy shit! I said I said normally I like even numbers. I might just take Crocodile at level twenty. Fuck it. Machop. Uh, just keep battling. Might as well. Fuck it. Fuck it. <laughs> Machop fight it, cause he's a bitch. He's a bitch, bitch, mate, nigga. Hey, get the fuck out of my face. All right, Pidgey. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna trade phone numbers. Okay, sure, fine. What what would happen if I just told everybody no? Would I just become infamous, inf, inf, infinite, <sighs> infamous as like the dickhead of Johto? All right, so, damn it. I can't tell if this is two different uh, people talking in the same text box or not. Okay, so, so, okay, okay, I, I got this, I got this, y'all, I got this. Who, who are you? You don't know us! We are ha, Team Rocket. What? what? I don't, I don't understand this text. Give me a break. We have not broken up. Actually, we did once. But we have come back to pursue Giovanni's ambition. Enough talking. Shut up and just beat it. Damn. Knocked you the fuck out, nigga. Uh, I'm not gonna fuck with you right now. Pidgey survived the poisoning. The poison fade away. Good shit, Pidgey. Motherfucking trooper, nigga. Motherfucking trooper. That's my nigga, Pidgey. Oh my goodness, oh my damn, oh my goodness, we go in and this is how a nigga is supposed to be. Anyways, I don't even know that's how the song goes.